There we go. All in one shirt. <laughs> We out here stomping the streets. Right. Got my mama's boy look. <laughs> <laughs> mama's boy. <laughs> Had a little bit of tough time deciding what I wanted to do this morning. I thought about going in and doing like a sled push workout. Um, but instead I chose to <clears throat> stay home, spend more time with these guys. The girls were still sleeping when we got up to walk, so uh, they'll probably be awake when we get back. And I need their beauty rest. <laughs> yeah, beauty rest. So, thankful November. Walk in November, actually. Walk in November. <laughs> One thing we're thankful for every day of November, and it has to be different every day. Um, I have to think, I have to remember what I was thinking of. Okay, I remember now. Um, I'm extremely thankful for options. Um, we have millions, billions, gajillions of options all around us, whether it be food, places to live, um, places to go, things to look at. We just have a very large variety of options all around us, and it's very cool. It gives us a chance to express ourselves and be ourselves and make choices. But like this morning, sometimes the choices can be tough. Like I go back and forth deciding, should I or shouldn't I? How will this affect this? How will this affect that? And sometimes it can paralyze you when really all you can do just take it one step at a time. So, today's gonna be an amazing Sunday. Yeah. Yeah! Say that again? <laughs> yeah, with butterflies all around. Butterflies <laughs> all around. All right, a little butterfly Sunday. Love you guys. Go spend some time with the people you love. sitting on the couch. I just got done reading my 10 pages. This book is pretty cool. I'll let you guys see a little bit of it. It's kind of like, whoa, I never thought of it like that before. Anyway, then I started looking at my Instagram story because I just wanted to. Anyway, uh, calling myself out because I made a commitment to do the November thankfulness every day, and I did November 1st and 2nd, but I didn't do November 3rd or 4th, so I'm going to do it today. Naughty me for not carrying through. But I am so thankful for our new house. I love our new house because although it's a manufactured home and it's a step in the right direction towards our dream home, it is so much better than our freaking apartment. Like, our freaking apartment, five people and 849 square feet to this home feels like a fucking mansion. I'm so grateful for our home. All right. Thankful. November 5th. Let's go.
With what? Hey, if you cut yourself, yourself, I'll cut you. With his own knife. Cover for the sharp part. Oh, oh, that's sharp. Do not touch it's it. It's not a joke. Put Don't it Don't treat it like one. No, put that thing back on. No, it. you can leave that off. Eh. Isn't that, I would keep it. Isn't that knife awesome? Dad, are you jealous? How do you close it? It's right here. See this piece of metal in here? Mm -hmm. little, little pokey parts there. Or not yeah. pokey, but rough. Gotta push that off to the side. It's kind of hard. Okay. Hey. Hey, Dad. Are you jealous? No. Are you jealous? <laughs> Can I put and water in this and drink water? Okay. Do you I push so. this up? Do you push no, this down. You pull it out like this. Okay. He's I got a pocket knife. Look at me. It's not a joke. Yeah. So quit treatment like one. Someday again, you'll be really doing it with you be you'll be really saying that. This that cup it can be a collection or something. Okay. Is Gideon's done? Is Gideon's done? Okay. Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm gonna open mine. Okay. <laughs> Dad, I'm Gates. Mommy, mom. It might not be strong enough to close it for a little while. Yeah. Okay. Push that off to the side. Okay. <laughs> Still don't cut yourself, bro. Oh my gosh, I know. I'm just saying, that's your own knife. You, you literally... Stop doing that. Okay. No mom's videoing you. It's okay. 
Okay. Uh, that one is this one. one. And I want called? that orange one right and there. this one. What's it called? Okay. That was the, I even put them on it. Not today, but. Maybe hook, we won't get duplicates. Muscle speeder. My, my. Hey, no That fair. was super cool, that Angie. Is <laughs> wow. I'm glad that aliens aren't that big. Day six of November thankfulness. Uh, I am thankful for the nice temperature. It's like 60 degrees out here, I believe. And it's nice. I like it. Uh, just ran a mile. Um, also thankful. I know it's two, but whatever. Uh, thankful for the daylight savings time because I was able to run in the somewhat daylight it's not pitch black out here right now so that's cool anyway uh remember to say what you're thankful for and uh go tag dakota he's doing a thankful challenge this month every day being thankful for something something different anyway gratitude is the biggest multiplier so be thankful mate. Good morning. Happy Monday. Um, upper body this morning. Ripped up some chest, ripped up some back. And feeling good. Feeling ready for a Monday. For a fantastic Monday. <clears throat> Something I've been thinking about. Um, comes with a little story, actually. Um, I grew up in Wyoming. Uh, and I did a lot of hunting with my dad. A lot of bow hunting, a lot of rifle hunting. Um, and when you shoot the deer, it doesn't always go down right away. Sometimes it runs off and sometimes you lose it. So then you have to track it. You have to track it by finding the blood and following the blood trail until you eventually find the deer, right? Okay, so this happened several times, okay? So I bring this up because with our goals in life, we can only take them one step at a time, right? So with that, <clears throat> what do we do when we find ourselves off track or when we find ourselves too far ahead, okay? We go back to the blood, okay? Sometimes you have to take a step back <clears throat> and go back to the blood to get back on track, to get back on track towards your goals, right? So when you're searching for that deer, and your goal is to find that deer, right? You lose track of the blood and you're like, shit, where am I at? I lost the, I lost the trail. I'm too far ahead. Sometimes you have to take a step back, find that last piece of blood that you found, that last spot of blood that you found and start from there again. So, <clears throat> take a quick look at where you're at. See if you need to step back. See if you've lost your trail. And if you have, all you have to do is go back to that last blood spot you found. 
keep moving forward. I love you guys. Let's have an amazing Monday. Let's get back on track. Let's keep moving. Okay? Yeah. Where's your scone, Ange? Oh yeah. What about yours, baby? Oh yeah. Someone's already. <laughs> Alright, Monday. Getting our sunshine and our steps in. Already knocked out half of math. Gideon's done with math. Angie's almost done with math. Grace is almost done with the lesson in math. Getting it. Let's go. Nope. Almost forgot my thankful November for today. I am extremely thankful for food. 